Today I'm going to be fulfilling one of my personal dreams, being an academy graduate at Liverpool. In today's video, you and myself are going to be choosing the worst midfield slash attacking talent that Liverpool's academy has. And basically, we're just going to pray that our career at some point will lead us back to Liverpool where we can win the biggest trophy of them all. So let's dive into this journey by kicking off and choosing Liverpool as my team. For full transparency, you and I are going to dive into this Liverpool club together. Whoever is the worst rated midfielder slash attacker is the one we're choosing, right? So show me my faith. Whose career are we going to be following? Who are we going to be? This is exciting. What do we have here? 48. Oh, it's a goalkeeper. Right midfield. That is the guy. Hernan Hidalgo from Bolivia. Okay. He is the lowest rated midfield slash attacking player. And that, my friends, is the guy whose career we are taking over today. We are a Liverpool Academy graduate. He is being promoted into the senior team. Let's give him a run with the team in a preseason tournament. Oh, cool. Just a bit of Real Madrid to start things off. Yeah, easy. Go on, Davin. Play me through. Oh, God. Oh, I'm getting the ball. No, I'm not. Let's play it down my side. Let's go, boys. Davin Nunez, my first touch of the ball. Hidalgo. Oh, that's the level of success I'm going to have here. I am not supposed to be here. Oh my... Yeah, guys, I don't think this is the level for us. Liverpool, please loan me out. Look, clearly we are not ready for Liverpool Football Club yet. So we are going on a loan deal. Our boy Hidalgo from Bolivia at the age of 16 is leaving to a second division in one of the top five leagues. And it is... And they see, yes, a team in the second division. Let's see if our boy can develop into a good player over there. The way this is going to work is he now joins this team. Anyone that plays in his position will be released from the club. So to make sure when we simulate through the season, he actually plays every single game. But at the same time, I get to play one single game with Hidalgo each season. And if I do well, and if I get a goal contribution, that means I get to boost up one of his stats that I want to choose. It can be anything, and it can be a plus 10 upgrade. I'm thinking possibly acceleration, anything like that, sprint speed, dribbling, all these things that I'm going to try and influence just a little bit without it being overpowered because I do want him to have natural growth as well. But a plus 10, I can get in that one game I play. And right now, as he's 57 rated, it's going to be very hard. Hopefully, his teammates are ready to support him. Hidalgo, this is your new team. By the way, all of this is done on ultimate difficulty, yeah? Not that you guys think I'm, like, playing on amateur or something. Couldn't be me. Did you make a run? Thank you, he does make a run. You go upwards. Oh, his passing is still as awful as it was at Liverpool. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Yeah, this ain't no second division football, my friends. You gotta be kidding. You know what? He's getting on the set pieces right now. He has 70 curve. Oh, we're left-footed. Good to know. Hidalgo, cross, inside. Center back, nearly scored. That would have been a plus 10. Come on, man. Don't be that fast. Don't be that fast. I can't keep up. Hidalgo, where you at? Help me. Just pass the ball. Why is this team so bad? Not again. It is It is happening again. Yeah, guys. Uh, so second division France, probably not a good idea. We need to go somewhere where things are even worse. The season has now finished. I've released anyone that was taking playtime away from Hidalgo. And he finishes with three goals. 61 rated at this stage. Just a heads up. It says 61 and a plus one because I had to rejoin the club. I got fired. <laughs> so yeah, that happened. Back to Liverpool we go. 
We got to find a better home for this guy. So it is time. Hidalgo is going away once more. And this time, I actually believe we're going to have a great season. And in that one game, I'm going to give my best because we are going to America. Hidalgo is joining Inter Miami before Messi can. And now our journey continues in the MLS. Now, having joined Inter Miami, let's take a look at their team. Joseph Martinez up top, a player that has uh, the experience over there. Pozuelo, former Toronto player, I believe. Gene Motta, who's actually doing really well this season in real life. And then it's us on that right midfield position. Hidalgo, I need you to work on those skill moves. I worked hard on the weak foot. Let's see if I can do well in that one game. But generally speaking, the defense does look weak in the center. So hoping that this team doesn't get crushed. Last game of the season. They are putting me up against Columbus Crew. This is for a plus 10 upgrade. And I want to use it wisely. What the hell is even that? Voice crack. Nice. Lovely. Go on. One more. Down the right goes Yedlin. He has the pace. Yedlin inside. Hidalgo. His pass does not arrive. Now his pass is at Yedlin's feet. It's an assist. It's a goal contribution. Yedlin scores. The first plus 10 upgrade has been secured for the worst academy graduate of Liverpool. Come on. Now let's do something with this. Great run down the center. Lovely work. Even better. Is that me? It is. Left foot. Oh, yes. Hidalgo. And he runs into the goal as well. That is his second goal contribution, which sadly doesn't mean that I get to go and give him a plus 20. But this game is done. And he's getting an upgrade. So season ends in the MLS. Hidalgo coming in now with a 63 rating. And I see dribbling on 60. That is not okay. So now I am jumping straight back in there. And we are seeing he's 64 rated. And he has 70 dribbling. That's the stat I wanted to focus on. Because as a winger, the dribbling stat is huge. So... Great improvement for the boy. Sadly, though, into Miami in our first season, only finishing in the eighth position, missing out on all the playoff fun. But it is what it is. We are going back to Liverpool and back out on loan. Since the Americans actually play up until January, I had to spend half a season at Liverpool and literally nothing happened. So Hidalgo is back at Liverpool, just extended his contract by three more years, 18 years old, 66 rated, we need a massive move, something that changes his life. I have made the decision of a lifetime for Hidalgo. We are going on a two-year loan deal, not just one this time around. I'm going to stick around and grow with a team that has gone from La Liga down into the second division in Spain into Smart Bank. Hidalgo is joining Elche, and the goal that we're going to try and achieve while we are there is to go ahead and get promoted back into La Liga. Hopefully, we can go from a 66 to at least a 72 at this time. And in this team, we have Ponce up top. Hauge on that left midfield. Guti in midfield alongside Mascarel. Hidalgo, of course, taking over right midfield. Four-star, five-star now. Lovely. Palacio, 74 rated. Yates is going to be a centre-back. Rocco, Gonzalez, Blanco and... Edgar Badia in goal. He's 32, should be okay. A decent bench as well. I got to make sure that we get as much play time as possible, though. First game. Let's get this going. Halfway through the season, just a quick update. Hidalgo, 69. <laughs> yeah, boy. And also, we are going to be taking a look at the league table before I dive into the game. Elche in the second position. Our second season at this club could well and potentially be in La Liga. And that scares me. But that, I need that plus 10 upgrade right now. Let's go after it. Oh, that's a great start. Yeah, just give him the ball. Yeah, sure. Why not? Give him the ball. Meet on this takeover. One goal. Lovely steal. Thank you very much. Into Ponce. I'm going to bring this to the left and then move it to the right. That's the play. Because then some space should be opening up here, technically. And it does. Mascarel. Into Hidalgo. Mascarel again. 
I gotta shoot! Wow. And I score! Assist for Hidalgo! 1-1! One, one. Yes! Plus 10 in our first season El and Elche is secured! I needed that badly. Oh! Gone! Big steal! He does have a fast start nope. weak foot! Oh, get out! <laughs> <laughs> I'm not mad at all. So for me, it is the finishing. We are at the end of the season. Hidalgo has already gone up to a 72, but in front of goal, I want to be better than this. So 67 finishing as we speak. And of course, when we go back in here, it should be at a 77. Hidalgo's stats are getting better and better. The Bolivian is a talent that people are recognizing now. And Elche has finished in the second position, which is going to send us up into La Liga to compete against the likes of Real Madrid and such. And I shouldn't really say compete. We're probably just going to get smashed. But let me just double check right here. How has the team done? Oh, boy. Congratulations. Great season, Hidalgo. Let's go. Seven and six. I will take that 13 goal contributions this year. Let's keep building on it. We're only 19 years old. I have chosen the toughest game of the season for Hidalgo. It's Real Madrid. I don't know why I'm doing this to myself. Because you're an idiot. It makes no sense. I'm trying that this team isn't getting relegated. That would be a huge achievement. What? I just put... You gotta be kidding. I just put in a perfect tackle and he just goes through me. Oh, wow. Yeah, you're pissing me off. One more pass over to the wing. Well positioned. Hidalgo. Pass inside. Finish. Nothing coming off of it. Hold on. Left foot. It's a good chance. Good try. There he is. Our boy on the ball. Ooh, that was impressive. Can he score? Nah, that should be worth the plus 10. That's a huge pass. One more, Mascarel, Hidalgo, crossing side, perfect positioning. Give me a goal contribution. Mascarel, Hidalgo, he needs help, man. All these guys need help. Boy, Hidalgo down the right, uh, down the left, I should say. Good pass, please, I'll take it. A late goal contribution. It's an assist once more. Elche getting a draw against Real Madrid. Am I dreaming? I don't think I am. This is our team actually doing well. Two years at Elche. And this result right here could actually keep them up. So Hidalgo's passing play is not perfect. And that goal contribution gets us a plus 10 that I want to use on his long passing. It's a 62 right there. And now it should have gone up to a 72 and it has that should hopefully help us out in making those amazing through balls for the strikers ideally that's what i'm going after here but i'm very happy with that upgrade and the fact that he's a 78 and the season has finished with elche in the 15th position 42 points was enough to survive and at the top barcelona beating real madrid and hidalgo how was your second season here at elche and the last season actually eight and four i will take that considering that it was much tougher opponents this time around and he has held his own and he's only 20 now coming back to liverpool i am realizing once again hidalgo has had great growth yes but we have players like Trincao, Elliot, Jota, all these guys not making it to the starting 11 because Nunez, Gakpo, and Salah are still here. Salah, 34 years old, going down in his rating, right winger. Keep that in mind because that's the position we want to take over at some point. But that point hasn't come yet. We need another loan. And this time, an actual top five league, ideally. I want to see what we can do. For us, it's time to go to Germany. This is the league where Jadon Sancho tore it up on the wings and made his move to the Premier League, right? That is what I'm going for here as well. Hidalgo is leaving possibly for the last time before the ultimate return at Liverpool for 12 months. We are joining Wolfsburg this is the right step in my opinion. At Wolfsburg, the team is actually looking very good. Silva up top, Elmas at an 85 in the camp position, Mike Trezor from Genk coming in on left midfield, Gomez 84 rated, don't quite know which Gomez this is supposed to be anyways, 
Maximilian Arnold alongside him and then Hidalgo coming in at right midfield with a 78. I want to see at least an 83 by the end of the season so we can be an actual asset to Liverpool's side. And then Luke Shaw is playing right back. Yep, that's happening. Simakan and Collins in centre back. Kukurella on left back because he's too bad for Chelsea. And Kelleha comes in in goal with a really good bench. I am sorry though. Musa, I probably will have to kick you out to secure playtime for my boy. Or is it going to be Trezor? Oh, it's going to be Trezor. He's 27. Yep, easy choice made. I have chosen the worst opponent to play against once again. It is us against Bayern Munich. Wolfsburg with us in the team has become a top six club again. Congratulations for that. But the season is not over. And the plus 10 upgrades. I want it badly for Hidalgo. Hopefully... He can get it now. Hidalgo. Left foot. Why not? Let's try it against Pickford. Pickford and Bayern's goal. Arnold. Good pass. Hidalgo. Making a run for it. Silva. Hidalgo joins in again. Here he is. The man brings the ball back too. The lad's in the center. I'm just going to take the lead right here. Just for Wolfsburg's sake. Hidalgo. No goal contribution. But hey. It is what it is. Nice back heel there as well. A through ball could be huge. It's Arnold again. Back. Hidalgo. Left foot. What? Are you kidding? That's your finish? That should be a minus 10. What the? It locked me off the ball. You have to be kidding me. This is not okay. How can you just lock me off the ball like that? Is that Julian Alvarez? I had that ball. It like... What the hell am I actually seeing? It's 1-1. Hey, it's a perfect situation for our boy to step in now. Oh, no. I swapped off my player. It's 2-1. Yeah, I, I, I guess me going ahead and taking the lead here was a bit ambitious. Can you guys hold on to a ball for a second? Thank you. Hidalgo. Silva. Great run. Cuts back in. Hidalgo, left foot. Not good enough. Today, we were just not good enough. Not the same level as Bayern Munich. We're going back to Liverpool with no plus 10 this time around. The team made it into a very far stage of the Conference League. It was the semi-finals, but got beaten against Atalanta. And in the league, securing a fifth position is quite the achievement. Very happy with that, considering that our a boy could not get anything done against Bayern Munich. It is what it is, but here he is. Six goals, eight assists, more assists than goals for the first time, I believe, which is good. 83 rated. It is actually fully time to join Liverpool once again now, and this time for good. No more loan deals. Liverpool only. Uh, okay, so I just left the team, right? I sent Hidalgo back to Liverpool, joined Liverpool, and he's 89 rated. No clue what the hell happened. He must have gotten glitched or something because I swear to God, I didn't change his attributes at all right here, guys. This is all EA is doing, so don't look at me. He comes in as an 89 rated player and Liverpool have brought in some really good players too. Gavi, 88. Don't mind that at all. That is a great addition into the team. And we also have the likes of Ndidi and Alaba and Salah is down to an 82. So it's only right that we take over that right hand side for Liverpool. But I do want to make a couple of signings before we go ahead and play this season until the end. Because I want this team to be able to win all the trophies. And you know what? This man deserves it. He's been working so hard to lift up any trophies in the future for Liverpool. So he is the captain. Let's go. Let's do this. Transfer window is done. I've gone a bit crazy. I have brought in Baldanzi. This guy, man, he came out of nowhere in FIFA 23, huh? Huge potential. 86 rated right now for us. At the back, I reunited Konate and Upamecano. The Leipzig centre-backs are here. And Hetrauda is taking over the right-back position for me to support Hidalgo in whatever he wants to do. So I wanted to bring in someone that is a bit more physical and can actually go ahead and run forward as well. So this is the perfect setup for us. 
this team can win it all. I believe in it. And Hidalgo is the one to lift that trophy if we get there. How about a European Cup final? I didn't even know, but Liverpool apparently did not qualify for Champions League football, and we are part of the Europa League. This season, they have finished in a third position up against Olympique Marseille. This is the first chance for Hidalgo to lift a major trophy. Who needed that? Upamecano, last man tackle. Why not? Davi Nunez, Baldanzi. Yes! Liverpool take the lead. 1-0. Great play. Olympique Marseille. What you got? That's back out. Sprints. And keeps on sprinting. Plays the ball. It's Baldanzi. Ooh, he's in a great spot. That could have been a plus 10, you know. In the center. A man is completely open. What the hell? How is he not scoring that? I should have taken a shot there. I don't know why I didn't. That was not smart for me. That's good football. You gotta score it. All the way down the right. Of course, our captain is waiting for that moment. Great through ball. Assists. Yes. Plus 10. Davi Nunez makes it 2-0. Give that trophy into the hands of the man himself. He gets himself an assist in a cup final in Europe. What more do you want in your career? I guess a Champions League trophy. Ooh. What the hell was that? Okay. All right. I see you. Well done. Their goalkeeper is out. Is this going to be an Alisson moment? No, it is not. Oh my God. He actually scored that. What? <laughs> wow. Okay. This is some final. Come on, Hidalgo. Let's do something about this. Late into the game. 90 plus 3. We should be nowhere near this stage of the game. But we are cross ripped in into nobody. Hold on. Score. Yes. I am winning it. You're not taking this title away from Hidalgo and Liverpool. Yes, mate. The captain steps onto the stage to lift his first major European trophy. But my friend... This is not the main prize. This is just a stepping stone on our journey to the biggest trophy of them all. Well done, Liverpool. Very happy with this, but I want more. And so does he. Since we got a goal contribution with him, I really don't like the reaction. So I'm going to give a plus 10 on that. It is 75. I'm going to take it up to an 85. And with that, this team right there should be capable of challenging for Champions League football. Since we have finished in the top four, I would love to go for that big trophy and the Premier League title, if possible. At first, we played against Espanyol in the round of 16 to then play against Real Madrid in the quarterfinals. AC Milan in the semifinals for the lads. 1-1. And please, yes! Oh, yes, guys. It is happening. A cup victory as well. The big question is, is there a chance of a treble? Because it seems like we have basically won every single match you can win right there in the month of May. So possibly this could be huge. Let me see what we got for us. Treble for the main man from Bolivia. Is that a possibility? Liverpool at the top. Yes. He is capable of winning the treble with Liverpool. An academy graduate that no one believed in but we did so our boy is on which rating 94 hidalgo 94 rated look at him insane nunez baldanzi Hakpo, gavi locatelli everyone just incredible alison and robertson have gone down in their stats but honestly it doesn't matter salah on a 73 <laughs> That is insane. Anyways, let me just double check the performance of the lads. Kakpo, wow. Nunez, great. Hidalgo, 18 and 15. Let's go. I like that. But wow, Kakpo and Nunez, they are just on fire. That man right there is a legend. And today we are trying to turn our Bolivian right midfield captain into a legend too. Mbappe and his boys are stepping onto the pitch. Some really good players in their squad for sure. But the one that we have to be aware of is Mbappe for sure. And he tries to slide tackle me. Oh, there's a run. Great pass from Hidalgo. Baldanzi. No. That was beautifully played. 
Oh, wow. I am impressed by Alisson. That's what I wanted to say. Back into our captain. Who's doing a great job right here. And he's trying his luck. Etralda trying to catch up to Mbappe. It's 1-0. Charles de Ketelar is the one scoring the goal. Kylian Mbappe is the one setting it up beautifully. Etralda too far away from Mbappe. I'm upset about that situation. We need to get back at them straight away if we can. Over the top. Lovely work. Davi Nunez. You need to bring me back here, pal. Shoot with your left. For God's sake, circle it around the goalkeeper, man. Hidalgo, left foot. Yeah, score that. Come on. Oh, mistake. <laughs> you cannot do that. You cannot do that. Donnarumma just cariusing it up in a Champions League final. There is no way he just did that. I can't believe it. I was going the other way. The AI decided I'm going to pass it to that man in the middle. And I was there with Darwin. Hey, not the most beautiful goal. I'll take it. Oh my God, this is so annoying. Mbappe passes it back. We saved it the first time. And we save it the second time. On to our captain. And moving it forward straight away. Hidalgo kicks it off. Davi Nunez in a great spot. Chips to keep on. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Bad decisions were made. <gasps> no. How could I do that? Oh, my God. Bro, what the hell was I doing there? Davin all the way to Hidalgo. The counterattack is on. He plays a great pass. Ball Dunsey. Yes. Oh, yes, Hidalgo. What a through ball that is. An assist in the Champions League final. Great run by Baldanzi. A perfect counter-attack after a big chance is missed by PSG. What more do you want than a beautiful moment like that? Take a closer look at this once more. Great pass, man. Ref, how is that not a foul there? You got to be kidding, man. Down the wings, they come late into the game. Yes, Konate. Love that. One minute left in this game. Yeah, sure. You aren't going to play that short now, are you? Donnarumma in there. Taking part of this. Konate, my hero. Hidalgo, get it away once more. Yes, he does. And it is done. And this moment belongs to the man who spent years away from the club to become an option. For Liverpool on that right-hand side, waiting for Salah his retirement and then taking over to become the new king of Liverpool. Incredible stuff, guys. This was so enjoyable. I really hope you enjoyed it too. A great story and hopefully a great video. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys want to see this more often, let me know which team I should do this with next. Have a great day, guys. Take care and peace.